Hi Pisces, welcome to your January reading. This is for my Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Uh, just take a resonates and leave the rest. Happy New Year's to you. Let's go ahead and jump right in here for you, Pisces, and see what we can expect with this new year. What is the new year bringing in for my Pisces? Hey, Spirit, messages for my beautiful Pisces. Let's see what that is. At the door. So a door, opportunities are waiting for you. Opportunities are waiting for you. All right. And you have the bow here as well. You are highly thought of, Pisces. And you have a door of opportunity waiting for you to open it. Step through. Okay. You have the staff. You will be taken care of in difficult times. All right, so you will be taken care of in difficult times. Ooh, I like it. You got the throne, position of authority. So some of you guys are going to be getting like a promotion or something. That's what I'm picking up here. This is like a promotion. This new opportunity you are highly thought of, right? Some of you guys already hold this position of authority. But whatever's going on here, Pisces, if you're going through a difficult time, um, you are highly thought of, you're cared about, you're loved, right? Um, people, people recognize you, somebody here, um, and you will be taken care of in difficult times. New creative ideas, a new venture, and a fresh start. Something that could lead to an increase in material wealth or spiritual growth, okay? Some of you guys may have moved recently. Some of you guys, this is a door to a new home. New home, new attitude. Got the dealings of relationship with the, uh, a woman here with blonde, gray, or white hair. The fair woman. Interesting. Let's go ahead and get you some more messages here. Messages for my Pisces. Hmm, got a fake friend afoot. Some of you guys may have had to um, cut somebody off here, right? Friendship, cutting off, cutting a friend off, fake friend and betrayed. So betrayed by a friend, having to cut someone off here. Got the government assistance on the bottom of the deck. Okay, so perhaps some of you guys um, have been having to survive off of government assistance. I know a lot of people have lately. Um, but uh, uh, spirit saying you will be taken care of in difficult times. So whatever this is here, you have some help coming in here. Position of authority. Uh, maybe some of you guys work for the government. I don't know. Uh, messages for my Pisces, please, spirit. Thank you. Got the car buying. Some of you guys may be buying a car. These are just random messages, all right? So some of you guys going to be buying a car this month, all right? Um, new home, new attitude, maybe buying a car too. You definitely have this new opportunity, but um, something to do with a fake friend here. Got the sick card on the bottom of the deck. Got the sick card. Okay, so maybe you're 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 um, going to be feeling a little sick this month, or uh, you will be getting sick this month. Um, interesting. But you will be taken care of in difficult times. You are highly thought of. So Dylan's a relationship with a, with a woman with blonde, gray, or white hair. Um, you know, this can be nurse. This could be mother, grandmother, wife. It could be anybody. Okay? Either way, you know, uh, this you are highly thought of. I feel like by spirit and the angels as well. They are taking care of you here. Wrong. Messages for my Pisces, please, Spirit. Triggers, name, car, place. Hmm. So some of you guys are going to be buying a car. Yeah? Okay, but triggers, triggers. Something to do with children here as well. Okay, children. Children. Triggers. Young, childhood, playful energy. 
some of you guys, your kids may be doing like online learning, like doing the uh, homeschooling, uh, stuff like that. Children, triggers though, triggers. I feel like I feel like this triggers card has to do it in in, regard, in regards to this betrayal by this friend here, right? Ooh, cobweb! You are protected from negative forces beyond your control, and then you got the pale. It's time to get out of a situation, and it's time to act. <laughs> Huh. So Spirit's saying, some of y'all, it is time to walk through this door, new home, new attitude. I'm telling you, this new beginning, hidden secrets can harm you with the school, betrayed, cutting off a friend, cutting someone off. February, misunderstanding. That's your energy, Pisces. February, February. Messages for my Pisces, please, Spirit. Some of you guys may be down and out right now with this sick, and um, maybe your children are trying to take care of you, right? You're highly thought of, right? Maybe they're taking this position of authority over you, loving on you, Mama, making you chicken soup and such messages for my Pisces. Oh, that's way too many. Way too many. Let's get one more though. Messages for my Pisces, please, Spirit. Roller coaster. Highest high. Adrenaline rush. So this may be an adrenaline rush here with this uh, car buying, right? It's exciting. I do see, the, I did see the firecracker, the excitement card, right? But this could also be like an adrenaline rush, like a, a getting triggered here, right? Um, I always see the roller coaster. It's like a roller coaster ride, right? Or extreme highs, extreme lows. Um, maybe in a commitment here. I'm definitely seeing our. I'm definitely seeing angelic protection here with the archangel michael we already saw that right you will be taken care of in difficult times and then the um the uh well i'm messing my cards all up here um that always happens okay well anyways jeez oh my gosh with the um cobweb yeah protected from negative forces beyond your control but spirit saying it's time to get out of a situation. It's time to get out of a situation. Someone feels trapped, scared, panic. This anxiety card, fear, fear, and um, what else came out in your pre-shuffle? What was I think? Just this fear and this anxiety, shadow work, something. This is like all in a panic here. Feeling trapped in a situation. Spirit saying it's time to go. It's time to act. You're being protected here. Someone hoping, wishing, praying in a panic, man. Someone is hoping, wishing, praying. Maybe that someone's not pregnant because we got that sick card here, right? Maybe someone's getting like morning sickness or something. Um, whew. Got the obsession and the access granted. Fake profile, social media, and hiding. Some of you guys, somebody, it may be pregnant here or something here. There's something to do with children, milk and donuts. Um, anyway, so anyways, but someone could be obsessively watching you as well here. Some weird energy, Pisces. Get one more shuffle. Got the Ten of Cups, bottom of the deck, right? Family, happily ever after, a happily relationship. Um, we'll see. Ooh, Ten of Swords. 
Ten of Swords. So this 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 is betrayal. This is this betrayal we're seeing here. Betrayed. Oof. Two of Cups. Fake friend. Fake friend. The Two of Cups is a friend. It's a lover. It's it's anybody. It's soulmate energy, but it's a partner, right? Friend. Cutting off this friendship, whether it's in love, whatever. Commitment. You know what I mean? Um, maybe this is sick and tired of being sick and tired, you know? This is maybe affecting your health, Ten of Swords. Fool. Leaving it all behind. Fool. New beginnings. There's a new beginning here. Oop, got the strength card out next. Could be dealing with a Leo or an Aries here. But the strength, this is getting that strength and that courage here. Um, I feel like whatever this is, this is definitely affecting your health because the, the strength in the reverse can represent ill health. You know, we got this sick over here. Um, this situation is making you sick. I feel like it's literally making you sick. Let's see her. Yeah. There goes King of Wands. You could definitely be dealing with the Leo there with that lion. The King of Wands. This is somebody, I'm telling you. Now that I messed my old, all my cards up, probably won't be able to find it, but we did, okay? Anyway, it is time to act. Look at that. You can't make this shit up. It is time to get out of a situation. This is someone who's extremely strong. Time to get out of a situation for happiness, peace, and harmony. Deep personal strength and peace that assures success. Very strong energy here. Someone may have cheated. Obsession. This person may have, you know, this is somebody who sees, you know, the King of Wands... He's very attractive. He's a go-getter. He sees something and he goes after it. This could be someone who is non-committal, right? Um, you are highly thought of, though. This could be like you. Every time I see these energies, I feel like this is like someone's other half here or something. You know what I mean? It's very interesting, though. Um, but this is this. This is this. It's time to act here. Someone needs to get the strength and the courage because this is all I was saying. The fear. I was seeing fear in your pre-shuffle, Pisces. Fear. Got the world. Yeah, I'm telling you. This door of opportunity is waiting for you to step through it. You're like in between worlds here, but this is a completion with the Ten of Swords as well and then a new beginning. We're literally stepping into a new world here. Ending, new beginning. The very last card to the very first card. This is a completion. This is a lesson learned. It's time to go. If you want this peace and if you want this harmony. Moon. Changes in your life. You will be playing a different role. Um, maybe you're going to be single parent now or something. But someone you know is undependable and insincere. This is like someone who can't resist their urges, you know what I mean? With this, you know, um, self-discipline and, and, and you know, no. There goes the Queen of Pentacles, though. Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. But this is someone who knows her worth, right? Knows her value. Solid, stable, abundant, loyal, committed, right? Hardworking business owner even, uh, but the wifey here, right? Commitment, commitment. This is someone who's committed, but see here, there's been betrayal here because somebody, this, 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 uh, this uh, relationship is not, 
they're not on the same page here. Um, and then there goes the star. Aquarian energy. Aquarian energy. This is this need to heal. This is have hope, have faith, right? There's a new inspiration. This is a blessing. You will be taken care of in difficult times. You are being protected here. Increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. This is like going on a journey. This is almost like, because the Ten of Swords, this is like something that will send you through your dark night, right? Um, and like an awakening. It's like a, uh, 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 there's like a rebirth here. Um, literally, this is all about renewal and purging and healing and that the fool and the star have hope and have faith here. Um, you will be taken care of in the difficult times, but you have this new beginning. And I'm telling you, it's going to lead to happiness. New home, new attitude, but it is time to go. Cobweb, you are being uh, protected from negative forces beyond your control. Too much concern with sexual matters, I was seeing. So somebody, yeah. Yep, someone too much too much concern with sexual matters, but you are being protected here, right? Um, protected, guided, um, and taken care of. We got the, oop. Got the Queen of Wands here, Aries Leo Sage. Fire energy is heavy here. Fire energy, right? Um, so this is a lot of passion. There is. This is a match here. Soulmate energy. But there is one king and two queens here, right? Some the queen of wands can always represent another woman. But this is this is something that's very exciting. We see that firecracker energy, excitement. Well, I may have lost it when all my cards fell, but nope, there it is. Firecracker, excitement. Hidden secrets can harm you. So you're, somebody may be hiding something from you. It's like this person may, I don't know if this person's already in a commitment or something, but um, hidden secrets can harm you. Too much concern with sexual matters. I'm seeing February and happiness, peace and harmony. I'm telling you, deep personal strength and peace that assures success, all right? But somebody may, I feel like I feel like whoever you're in this commitment with, because I almost feel like it's you who are in the commitment with this person. This person has too much concern with sexual matters, too much concern with celebrating, partying, going out. You know what I mean? This is non-committal energy here. This is someone who's, it's like while well, you're committed and shit and ready to settle down and, you know, um, whatever this person is not um this person lacks self-control and self-discipline here um but there's definitely i mean this is definitely some soulmate energy here passion uh, but this is this new beginning taking this leap of faith taking this action it is time to act there's a new creative idea here it's exciting right um, it's exciting. You got to walk through that door there. There goes the eight of wands. So some kind of movement, forward movement, movement, new home, new attitude. I'm telling you what, it's time to act. It's time to act. Spirit is saying it is time to get out of this situation. It's like there's just been too much betrayal here. Um, Protect. There goes another one. Protection from a powerful friend. I, psychic ability, trust your intuition. I feel like spirit is speaking to you, sending you messages. I feel like you guys are very, very connected to spirit right now. Psychic ability on point. Trust your intuition in matters of love, in matters of the heart. There are going to be changes in your life with the moon. You will be playing a different role. Feather, someone you know is undependable and insincere. But you have, the, I'm telling you what, you got this new creative idea here, this new creative venture, a fresh start, new home, new attitude. Okay, it's exciting. This is news arriving, but this is travel as well. This is literally like movement, like long distance travel. Somebody may be traveling here, going somewhere. Um, Car buying, car buying. So by car, um, 
plane, train, automobile, I don't know. But going, this is like uh, traveling. So this could be a long distance move or just moving in general. Um, so, but messages with that eight of wands. This is also somebody, you know, this, this messages of love going back and forth. But this is also, um, this is somebody who may have uh, uh, many choices in love as well. Like the king of wands, he's always got choices. He's always got options. Keep, You know what I mean? Um yeah, whatever's going on here, there's a misunderstanding, a wall. I'm telling you, there's like no getting on. These, they're not on the same page no more. Yeah, but that's that's some kind of messages right there. Um, but movement, ten of cups on the bottom of the deck though. I feel like I feel like this is this happiness, this happily ever after that's coming. But spirit, seen, gotta move. <laughs> It is time to act. I don't know whose message this is, but it keeps coming out heavy, heavy with fire energy. Fire, fire, fire energy. Time to go. Um, uh, Aries energy is here heavily. Time to get out of a situation. Um, matter of fact, I think that came up in Aries uh, reading for last month. I think, <laughs> wake up Aries. I remember it was somebody's reading. Um, but it keeps coming through heavily, which means somebody isn't listening here. Uh, someone is not listening their intuition. It is time to go, Spirit says. Whew. Um, if you want this happy, if if you want this happiness, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, and you'll 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 get that increase in material wealth as well. Position of authority. I'm telling you what. New opportunity are waiting for you. It's exciting. It's passion. It's create. I'm telling you what. Happy, happy, happy. Whew. Amazing. Ace of Cups, bottom of the deck. So this definitely has something to do with matter. This definitely has to do with love. Matters of the heart here. Okay. Um, you are highly thought of. You'll be taken care of in difficult times. I'm telling you what. Betrayal. In this relationship, in this foundation, in this marriage, betrayal. This is like sabotage. Um, but can't take it anymore. Five of swords to the six and the four. I'm telling and the eight of cups. So you got the eight of cups, the six of swords, and the tower, and the five of swords. It's like you win. Spirit saying it's time to go. Major betrayal here. Major betrayal. Time to go. And you will be taking care of difficult times. There's going to be a need to heal here. Um, geez. Whew. Um, let's get your clarifiers here. So, Ten of Cups, Ace of Cups. Oh, my God. Someone out there shooting guns. One more shuffle, please. Eight of Pentacles, bottom of the deck. Work. Something to do with work. This is a rebuilding, though, as well. Focusing on yourself, your money, your career, your newfound, this new home, right? Whatever this is. Working hard to buy this car, even. Um, let's keep going, though. Uh, emperor, position of authority. Position. So somebody needs to take a position, a position of authority here. The emperor is like the high. Uh, what you know sits in a very high a power of authority. So there's like a leader here, a boss type of energy. More Aries energy. <laughs> Fire energy. Mars. Heavy. Um. Father, husband, the masculine. Someone got betrayed here. It's either the masculine. Someone likes to be in control. This is someone who may be very controlling. Um, but very strong and masculine nonetheless. Um, <laughs> uh 
Uh, so I don't know if it's a masculine that's getting betrayed here because it is sitting on top of the Ten of Swords. Or um, it's the masculine that's doing the betraying. So some of you guys, it's your person because we got this, I'm telling you. Someone's upset watching you. So if somebody's been blocked here. That's why this is so weird to me. I'm telling you what. Look at where this new beginning is heading, heading, taking you. You to your nine of cups, Pisces. You ain't just seen the ten of cups, the ace of cups. This is like a fool in love coming in here. Could be. But it is a new beginning, and it's going to lead to abundance. Increase. You, some of you guys are going to be getting this because you will be playing a different role. So this could be a new job, um, a new relationship, whatever it is. You're going to be taking this position of authority and you're going to see an increase in material wealth. And it's going to lead to happiness. It's exciting. This fresh start. Whew. But Spirit says you got to go if you want this wish granted, this wish fulfillment. This is something that could lead to like fortune and fame. This is a leader. This is someone who it was, could be like an inspiration to others. Um, you got the strength and the five of pentacles. So this is this is like very feeling very much um, lack of lack of motivation, lack of drive is what I'm getting here. Um, door of opportunity. Somebody has got to get up out of this energy here. I mean, this is like neglect, abandonment, betrayal. Um, there could be something to do with something, in, uh, child neglect, child abuse. And I just got to say that because I'm seeing it now and because it's sitting right there. But... Someone needs to get up their strength, get up their courage. This is like um, lacking the strength, lacking the courage, lacking the get up and go here. But you have this fucking door. The key sitting right there. You have the key. You hold the key. Maybe you're feeling alone right now. You know, maybe you did just get this new home and, you know... And I don't feel like it. Sometimes you can be in these relationships and still feel alone, abandoned, neglected. Spirit saying, you got this door of opportunity. You got the keys. Oh, look at all the keys. The keys, keys. Um, it's time to act, Spirit says. It is time to act. Quit crying over the spilled milk. I know this is the five of pentacles, not the cups. But, I mean, this is basically the same energy here. Um, but sick, sick, sick. Definitely someone's health is being affected here. King of Wands with the judgment. Someone needs to take action. Literally, the judgment is being called to action. Being called to action. This is a final decision. Finalities. Closure with the world. We got we got 21. We got the 20 to the 21 and then the zero. Like literally, completions, endings, a breakup with the five of pentacles. Someone could be facing judgment for some kind of child abuse here. This is like, you know, someone really needs to be some gentle to like someone needs some tender, loving care here. I see this lamb and like 
Someone may have like dealing with a parent that has some kind of split personality or something here. This person's like sick in the head, or, you know? What's this world? There goes that six of swords. I'm telling you what, leaving it all, it is time. Door of opportunity to leave. Pack your bags and go. There goes a high priestess. Trust your intuition. Your psychic ability is on point right now. Trust your intuition. Hidden secrets can harm you. The high priestess can represent hidden motives, hidden agendas, something that's hidden here. Um, it's very interesting. Neat hand in need of help guidance and assistance a distant friend is thinking of you see so some of you guys it's your person going through this shit or something like that but I'm telling you what psychic ability trust your intuition in love you will be playing a different role. If you feel like your partner is cheating or whatever, or whatever it is that you're suspecting, I don't know. Someone gonna be getting cut off though. Got the star and the chariot headed towards guaranteed success. You are on the road to success. You are on the right path. You are being guided here. It's like spirits in guided in, in control of this chariot here. Um, but being guided for sure, for sure. This is unexpected help arriving. Literally, the chariot. It's an arrival or a departure. And the star is a blessing. It's an un, it's like unexpected help. It's an unexpected blessing, something like that. Literally, unexpected help is arriving. You are going to be taken care of. You're being guided to take action. Whew. You will have guaranteed success here. So whatever fear is holding you back. Whatever fear is holding you back is literally in the hopes and fears position. Someone is fearing this new beginning. Fearing taking this action. There's fear. Staff though. You will be taken care of in difficult times. You're being guided. Guiding light here. There's a... Caddy, 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 caddy. I'm hearing cat fight. I was hearing that in my daily too, and I forgot to even mention it, but I was. Cat fight. Betrayal. So this could be between two, like a friend, you know what I mean? I'm hearing caddy. <laughs> Something triggered. Got this triggered over here. Someone going to may test you here. Um... Nine of Wands, it's like kind of being pushed into a corner or something or someone throwing obstacles in your way. I'm seeing someone definitely is being, uh, health is being affected though in a situation. Sick. Um, Eight of Wands though, Six of Cups. Eight of Wands, Six of Cups. There could be a child leaving home. A child traveling, something to do with children here. This is messages from someone from the past, even someone from the past returning because the Six of Cups is memories of love, it's memories of the past, but the Eight of Wands is messages, but it's also travel, it's movement, going back to a place of childhood, thinking of the child. New home, new attitude. Some of you guys may be moving back to a place, like I said, of childhood. A distant friend is thinking of you. World, eight of, eight of wands, six of cups. A distant friend is thinking of you. 
dog, protection from a powerful friend. Something to do with dogs and protection. Something special about someone's dog or maybe this, maybe something happens when you're out and about and your dog protects you even. Something to do with dogs. It's funny because my dog's laying right down here at my feet. Interesting. Something from the past returning though. Messages here. Messages, you could be messaging with your children, something to do with traveling and children. But this distant friend who is also thinking of you. Short journey. Yeah, someone going on a journey here. And protection from a powerful friend. Psychic ability. Trust your intuition and in matters of the heart. Someone may be in need of help, guidance, and assistance. This person may be, or you are. So if someone reaches out to you in need of help, maybe, you know, use your intuition here. No. Interesting. But I see happiness, man. Happy, happy, happy. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, gifted. Gifted. I'm seeing star seed energy here. Receiving a gift. Oh, you're going to be blessed here. That this is being very gifted. Remember I was saying getting messages from spirit and shit? Yeah. Very psychic, psychic, psychic. Some of you guys may work as psychics, as healers here. Any kind of here. Tarot readers, crystal healers, whatever. Very, very powerful energy. Um, this could really pay off for you. Some of you guys do work. Some of you guys' this position of authority, like I said, is a raise or a promotion or a new job or something like that, you know? So, but oof. Where's that? Boom. This is a loss. Somebody's definitely going to be in dire straits. This is like losing it all. This is financial ruin, but this is this divorce. Someone, I'm telling you what, this commitment here. This commitment. There goes the hierophant, bottom of the deck. But this is this, this spiritual um, protection you'll be taken care of you're highly thought of all this direct connection to spirit but it's also in regards to this commitment but it's also in regards to this position of authority with the emperor i mean this is like a father figure a judge husband masculine energy but spirit increase in spiritual growth or material wealth i feel like it's both new exciting ventures a fresh start yeah it's exciting but there's fear spirit is saying go for it go for it pisces oh no. some of you guys whoever this friend is you had to block them i don't know if someone's i don't know what the fuck going on here That's what I have, though. Um, there could be someone who's trying to use the children as pawns, you know what I mean? I'm seeing some, I don't know, very controlling neglect. I don't know. I don't like this child abuse. I keep picking up on this child abuse shit, too, so I don't know what that's about. So there could be a father who's facing judgment for that, you know? Anyways, um, that's what I have. Pisces, like the video, hit the like button, leave a comment down below. 
And um, until next time, bye-bye, blessings.